look at this lovely dish, people, of cheese and Vegemite, Mel Vegemite melted. You can smell it. That's what we're making. That's what we're making today, and uh, we're going to have a great time making it, people. Just kidding. No, we're not going to make <laughs> like that. We're, and this is the purpose of making good food. food. We're going to make pasta again, but over this thing, which doesn't even fall off the plate if I hold it upside down a bit, but I'm not going to try it. We're not going to make something that shit. We're going to make good food. Clean up the shavings of the onion later. Alright. So, come on, that is not on my head height, I can tell from there. So, uh, pasta's boiling away, I'm just going to start the process here, speed it up. Look at this, I'm using a proper onion this time, people, so, cue the waterworks. <laughs> what? I know the cure for watery onion eye syndrome, whatever you want to call it. Onion cry syndrome, I don't know, whatever you want to call it. This is why I'm wearing safety glasses so I didn't get onion in my eye. And the, cure, and the cure for that is to look at water. Yeah, that's simply it, view. It's literally just look at water. But I'm going to take a quick pause because I feel this pasta of mine, this really nice pasta, I've tasted it. It just tastes delicious. <coughs> Can you not burp over it? Yeah, that's where we Dumb Why have you still got to hide doing this? Because I think technically, if you want to have a function at your house with alcohol, you'd have, to, you'd have to get a limited alcohol license. Chopping board. Don't cut, don't cut onion. Don't cut onion. Shut up. Oh. Perfect. Preparation is a, a bit of a foreign word to Chester sometimes. Huh? Preparation is a bit of a foreign word to you. Preparation is a foreign word to Be Because if you thought ahead in advance, you would have already got the that out. It's all stuck to the bottom. This is my favourite part of cooking pasta. Mm -hmm. When I don't pay attention enough, and as good as it is on the top, it all sticks to the bottom. Come on, get out. Mm -hmm. Whatever. It's all 
glued itself to the bottom. Mm -hmm. Look, people, do you want to show the camera this, Tim? No, I'm too <laughs> late. You should look. <laughs> I've got a case of lazy-itis. Before I finish taking it out, this is what I'm left with, people. This is why you should actually try and keep an eye on your food. Mm -hmm. Whatever. I'll fix it, don't worry. What should we call this? Perfect, perfect carbonara. You rock. Don't do what I'm doing, people. Oh. I'm just getting it out of the thing. What's oh my word, it tastes nice though. What's this pasta called? Bowtie pasta. I have an Italian name, but I can't remember what it is. Gee, you're useless. Well, I'm sorry, Tim, what is it? I know, you can go and fetch it out of the bin. Hmm? You can go and fetch the packet out of the bin. No, no, it didn't have the Italian name on the packet. Oh, there it is. You're sitting in the wrong place. Right. Right. Finally, the frying pan comes out, people. Hold the camera up. They can still see you. That's about your shoulders. Yeah, they need to see my head, not my shoulders. <laughs> well, they probably need to see what I'm cooking. But yeah. They can see that that's alright. Just a fails with the light layer as usual. There we go. Mm. So now I'm cooking with real onion, people. Oh! Ah. Jesus Christ. Mm. Get ready to watch it fly. Don't go far away when I'm cooking. Oh. Oh. I had to come closer. Mm. I have the worst cameraman. Camera operator. You don't see cameraman anymore. And the most and the most pedantic <laughs> smart ass one as well. Mm. Don't need these on anymore. Uh. I'm using a clean spatula. Wooden spoon. Wooden spoon. Don't make me hit you with it. <laughs> because cross contamination, people. He's bad. Yes. I'm not going to use the same spoon to stir around the pan that I did to. That's, cut, that's sitting in dirty pasta pan water over there in the sink. And the, the camera up to me. It's like filming the cauliflower right now. No, it isn't. It's higher than that. What, about here? No, I can see your head. Oh, okay, good. But ideally, they want to see what's in the pan, but whatever. <sighs> so I'm getting a nice... Well, I can't tell you what's going on in this pan because you can't see it. And you... I might as well just stand like this in front of it. Mm -hmm. Rip open the ham. Oh, this is much more interesting. Huh? Reading this. Finesse with this today, people. I have to be honest. 
and it's literally spitting now the oil. Maybe I'm going to turn it down a bit. Stop it. Oh, I meant to drain the corn and I haven't even done that yet. Ugh. Stop with all the damn swearing. This makes more it didn't work for me. I didn't swear then. You did. I said I meant to drain the corn. No, before that you did swear. Oh really? What was I saying? I'm not going to repeat because that <laughs> means another thing you have to figure out. It's like stop with the damn swearing and then you repeat it. So yeah, I'm an idiot people. I forgot to drain the corn. Mm -hmm. Stupid me. Mm -hmm. I'm rushing myself right now pretty much. Mm -hmm. Because one of the stories they told today was a peaky machine was on fire, a person was playing next to it, and they didn't care, they just kept on playing. Right, a pokey machine was on fire. Fire, and the one next to it had a, per a gambler on it, and they just kept on playing. Got this two page list of indicators of problem gambling. <laughs> Alright, now, now I've got the hand going. Now I've got the hand going to put the onion. Now, I'm going to really quickly end up. I'm the idiot who forgot, to drain, forgot that I had to drain the corn. I forget to add the sauce next, probably. No, no you don't! Oh my god! The camera can see that, right? Yeah. Not now, come on! You have to go and get the tin opener. Chester. Oh, I've got it, fine. If you stabbed yourself, it's your own fault. I know it's my own fault if I stabbed myself. Oh, it's going to turn soon. Corn. Yeah, in, actually, maybe I shouldn't have Maybe I should just cook it a bit. So this is, lo this is loaded with ham and sweet. This is loaded with ham and sweet corn. Mm -hmm. You know what? I don't think there's enough ham in there now. Mm -hmm. Okay, so... I'm on to my fifth piece of ham in this dish, people. And every bit I add more of the time, oh, it's going to be a mess. It start, the pasta was cooked perfectly, but I didn't drain it. It's gone all clumped together now, and just, this dish is just disintegrating, basically, minute by minute. Mm -hmm. You have about ten minutes of video footage remaining. I'm gonna, I'm not gonna, there's no way that's going to go over, but this is definitely going to be finished by then. Are you sure? Yes. I'm adding the sauce to him. All I've got to do is add the pasta and mix it through. Once it's all mixed in here. <laughs> See, I'm going for a different approach though, people. As many of you know, I usually add the sauce last. Well, I've seen a lot of cookery videos on YouTube, and let's just say I don't think I was doing it right before by adding the sauce last. Because the sauce is always cold if you add it last. But that's a good thing. How's that a good thing, Tim? Who wants to eat hot pasta with a stone cold sauce? Yeah, I don't, I don't like hot pasta. I'd rather have it both them cold. Yeah, you're different, Tim. If I was cooking for you and you only, I wouldn't even cook anything. I'd give you just a bag of raw pasta, tip sauce, put it in a bowl, pour sauce all over it. Put raw, sweet, uncooked ham, uncooked onion. But I wouldn't even have onion. Oh, you wouldn't have onion. Sorry, uncooked ham and onion. And just sweet corn, not even drain, I just tip it all into the bottom. I probably wouldn't have that either. Fine, just ham then. 
Let's just see what this tastes like because Tim eats it all the time. How the hell do you eat that? That tastes revolting on its own. So you'd probably get the Italian name, I'd probably have to go and look up a list of pastas and match the picture. Yeah, Bowtie, Bowtie Pasta does have a name. I just yeah. can't remember it. Yeah. Alright, that's getting warm now. Finally, I can add this pasta. Oh, this is going to be ridiculous, this. <laughs> I was shielding that damn nut. The camera didn't see any of it. It literally just came out upside down. It did that. It's just like a mound of pasta in the bowl now, and I've got to mix it up. You did that last. at the last time you did pasta. Oh, true. <laughs> just look at the mess I make, Sam. Just show them that. That's what I make. That's the. You see any other night anyone's cooking dinner here, this will be just filled with plates. What I'm making is filled with bags, paper, pans, food. Alright, now the time you just cluster <laughs> war zone kitchen up. Oh, another word of bleep. Oh, we sound like now the time you just cluster me of a war zone up. Crunch up my hand and chuck it in the fridge like I like have a single care for in the world. The thing's about to pass out, it looks like on a bag. Oh, disgusting. The other onion. Whacked him over the head with it. Literally just chopping it in that thing. Yeah, yeah. Cans are recyclable. Oh, of course. It means you have to wash it out. Mm. Washing the washing machine, boys, if you want it washed. Mm. Whatever. Yeah, I don't know how it's going to all fit in the washing machine. It might be. <laughs> I love oh. the thing in the can. Mm. I haven't even turned it off yet, what the hell am I doing? Film. Can you see me? Yes. So, at my head, specifically. Yes. That's the part you cut out when I'm saying all that, anyway. So, that's another pasta dish. But, using the usual paradigm that meals in this family follow on, me, me cooking the same main ingredient every night but changing it up still surpasses is different so um yeah i mean not that you could see much that was going on everyone blamed tim for that you suck tim you gay all right um thanks for listening this is watching this is heaven's kitchen episode four yeah four i don't know they're all, they're all the same food aren't they so it's probably still episode one <laughs> Peace out and, uh, yeah, cook like me. The dream. By the way, guys, keep one thing before I go. Sometime soon I'm going to be filming this very special video where I attempt to make a pasta-themed dessert. That's right, so keep an eye out for that one because that one's going to be coming up in a while. Yeah, uh, other than that, peace out and uh, cheers for watching, guys. Later.